Back to Stormwatch right now. We saw Steve Large earlier in El Dorado County dealing with the snow. It looks like it's eased up a little bit, Steve. Yeah. Yeah, definitely not coming down the way it was about a half an hour ago, but you can definitely see on the ground lots of accumulation. We just had a snow plow plow some roadways here so people can get to the grocery store, at least in the morning, perhaps. Uh, listen, one of the things that people along a Highway 50 corridor are they're concerned as much as they enjoy seeing this snow here is that when this happens, a lot of folks come up to enjoy this snow. Some of them don't want to get stuck in Highway 50 traffic, though, so they're using their cell phones and traffic apps to find shortcuts through these local city streets. It is the first big snowstorm of the season, and the long lost sight of snowflakes falling from the sky. It starts doing this, it's just money coming out of the sky. And I don't care what you're doing. If you're going to skiing, plowing, chaining, shoveling roofs, all of it. Awesome. Tell you to stop. Chain installers have also returned. This winter like weather reminding motorists trying to make it over the mountain on Highway 50 to be prepared. I had to go Black Friday shopping. Shannon Fox lives in South Lake Tahoe and drove over the mountain for some quick Christmas shopping. The snow arrived before she could get back home. For her, no problem. No, I got it down. Frustrated. I'm very frustrated. We Kenny Kurtzweiler lives in Myers, where people using travel apps like Waze have increasingly rerouted themselves through his neighborhood to bypass Highway 50 traffic during winter months. Organized efforts by neighbors and El Dorado County to stop the apps have gone nowhere. When people are leaving town and the traffic backs up, they're going to get on their apps and they're going to say, oh, I've got a shortcut through the neighborhoods because it'll save them one minute. And what that'll do is that'll back up the neighborhoods and then we've got people going to the bathroom in front of our houses. The return of snow in the mountains on Highway 50, it may mean more frustration, even if it is a stunning show. And a live look at this stunning show right now is that snow plow continues to do its work through this uh, Pollock Pines parking lot. We did make it all the way up to South Lake Tahoe and back tonight. And I have to say that for the most part, it was very slow going. Only saw one spin out and there were no reports on Highway 50 of any major injuries, guys. All right, Steve. Thanks. Be safe coming back down the hill live in Pollock Pines tonight.